Hey, yo. So look, y'all, I'm super excited. Um, thankful for everybody that's tuning in and giving me the air of the eye. I appreciate you. I don't want to hold y'all on, but this is just going to be the intro video. I just want to introduce y'all and give y'all a preview of kind of what I'm going to be doing. This is going to be uh, book reviews. As you see, I got all these books here. I'm super excited to, uh, you know, bring this to y'all and to do this. Um, it's one of my favorite things to do is to read. And yeah, I pretty much like this is these books right here. Uh, for those watching the video, um, these books right here are just some of the some of the books that I read in this past year. Um, a few of them are ones that I kind of just read over, like I just kind of go through them all the time because. Uh, the one thing about books is they're timeless and um, like success principles, they last forever. They don't like just go away. Uh, you got to apply different things in different times. But uh, what, was, what, was, what was successful and worked in the 1900s still to this day work. They just work in a different application in a different manner. So... Yeah, with that being said, like I said, I'm just going to be doing book reviews, bringing uh, some of my favorite books to y'all, breaking them down, giving y'all like the authors, what the authors are about, what the book's about. Um, yeah, like the purpose of the book, like the kind of like some of the top gems of the book, just kind of just the overall kind of like synopsis and summary of the books and uh, just kind of what they mean to me. Uh, why y'all should read it if you haven't already read it or don't know about it and yeah just sharing that knowledge and hopefully open up the conversation and you know opening up like you know you know your mind to you know maybe diving into the book or you know the subject matters at hand like one of my favorite books that I feel like uh, I feel like everybody needs to read is The Secret, China Study, Black Labor, White Wealth, and uh, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. Uh, those are just some of my favorite ones. Uh, the China Study, just because of a lot of reasons, uh, but mainly just it, it breaks down, kind of debunks a lot of stuff. Uh, gives scientific fact into like a lot of nutrition and, and things and yeah and then the secret is just it's it's good um has a lot of stuff in there when i get to this book i'll i'll give you all the juice of that the the sauce of that book um but yeah first book i'm gonna actually go into though is um kobe kobe bryant's uh mama mentality book that was, it's a it's a good book. I'm gonna I'm break that one down for y'all. That's gonna be the start of the many book reviews that I do, and I'm excited to bring it. Yeah, like I said, I just hope I can spark the conversation, open up minds, and just you know get people to start reading more. Hopefully, start a book club. You know, goals, goals, goals. Uh, <laughs> now, nah, but yeah, seriously though, um, that's just one of my big things is. You know, getting people to read and you don't have to necessarily get a hard copy. That's another thing that I know, like for most people that like I talk to kind of have conversations with is, you know, the hard thing for them is staying in tune with a book, like having the book. Because I know, like, I mean, I, at some point I didn't like reading because of what school did. You know, so like you don't want to pop open a book like you ain't getting no AR points. So why read? Um, <laughs> but no, um, got off on the tangent there. But there's audio books and then there's ebooks, too. So you have many different reasons why. So like you can you can read you can read a book without actually have to have the actual book and read it. My thing is, is I eventually have to get the card copy because I like doodle, make notes, all that good stuff. And with like the ebooks, you can't do, you can't necessarily do that. You know, you can grab a notebook and do that. And then like with audio books, you can like grab stuff and do that. Um, but I'm a visual, I'm, I'm a, I'm a visual and, um, 
you know, um, audio person. Like I can listen to listen to it, but I'll kind of forget it if I I'll kind of forget it if I don't write it down. Especially with like, like you know, like with nuggets like that with gems. Like you listening to music, you listen to people talk, all that, and then at the end of the day, you're trying to remember, you know, something that was said maybe earlier in the day when you woke up, because that's how you maybe start your day or on your lunch or something. It's like, yeah, all right. <laughs> Not remembering that, you know, if it really sits, it'll really sit. But for the most part, it's a lot of stuff that gets said in books um, or that's in books that, you know, if you're reading the right books, you, you know, you would come away with a lot of stuff. So, yeah. Um, yeah. Like I said, didn't want to hold y'all long. We six minutes in, and this, like I said, just the intro. And I appreciate y'all who do make it to this point. Um, we're going to keep rocking. Kobe, Kobe Mama Mentality book is coming up this, you know, soon. First one. So, yeah, like I said, if you like a book, interested in a book, I get all my books from Barnes & Noble and Amazon for the most part. Um, there's a lot of places you can get them, but... Like I said, uh, Barnes and Nobles is my spot that I go to, and the Amazon usually has everything you need. <clears throat> Originally a bookstore, so um, yeah, I usually go to those two. Um, but yeah, let's collaborate. If you do see a book that you like, um, I'm willing to like, like I said, I'm open to the conversation even before I get to a book. If you're interested in a book, let's chop it up. You know. Um, Cause that's, you know, that's the whole purpose of it. I want to open up conversations, start conversations and get people reading more. So yeah, I'm excited y'all. Hope y'all excited. Um, even if you're not, I guarantee you, you will be, um, something. I hope some, I hope you do hope one of these books stick and lead you down the path or something. Um, definitely for all my folks, black labor, white wealth. Yeah, man. All right. Well, I appreciate everybody that got to this point. I love y'all. I'll see y'all soon. If you are listening via audio, um, I'll leave the video link in, uh, on my Instagram, Twitter. Uh, it'll be on my Facebook too. And then for everybody that tuned in video, uh, just like and subscribe and share and do all that good stuff. If you don't do none of that, I still appreciate you because really all I care about is you tapping in. So, all right, y'all. Appreciate y'all.